Man, I don't know what we can all do, Alice and the Great. Do you have any good ideas? Um, I don't exactly know. A cooking maybe. I personally couldn't do one by myself, though. Alice and the Great, are you calling me a chef cooking man? Ahem. Are you guys making those stupid rubbish New Year's resolutions again? Why? Absolutely yes. We are making those New Year's resolutions. Old Kalo, you got a problem with that? Yes, I do sure have a very big problem. New Year's is the world's most overrated holiday, and resolutions are stupid, dumb and useless. Every year this always happens. You always give up on those stupid New Year's Eve resolutions by the first weekend of the year. Well, I guess you are going to have to deal and admit it with it. It's not like these resolutions are seriously affecting you in any possible way. Oh really? Well, if I can recap from last year when I lived with the same parents as you five, they made a resolution to end quote punish me in more powerful way. Old Galu, that was all last year. Chances are that this year's resolutions will never affect you in any possible way. Yeah, right. You're lying piece of garbage. The stupid New Year's resolutions affect me every single stupid year. <laughs> Old Galu, how dare you swear on New Year's Eve? That's it. You are so grounded grounded for two additional months. Get your butt to your room right now and go to bed. Fine. I can't believe I'm always getting grounded already. God. This is so stupid. I've been stuck in this room for two straight months, which means I'm stuck here for the new year, and this is super extremely unfair that my parents, my grandma, my brother and my sister get to have all the fun they want for new years while I am stuck in this room. I am unable to go out with my troublemakers or my friends, or even getting to watch the ball drop on television. Yo, old K.I.U. I thought you said that New Year's is the most dumbest and overrated holiday of the entire year. Shut up Kalu Animate, nobody asks and cares for your opinion on Christ's stupid saying. Yay, watch your mouth, and why would you care about having fun on New Year's while you're stuck in your room? Kalu, shut the heck up, and why are you inventing my personal videos? Yay, this is the second time I've told you to watch your mouth, and stop breaking the fourth wall. They're my videos, not yours. Kalu, just stop talking and complaining and go away. Fine. I'll just leave. I don't ever want to deal with you anyways. Thank you for leaving. And don't come back until you make good and ungrounded videos out of me and my best troublemaking friends. Anyways, if I can't have fun on New Year's Eve, I don't think that my parents, grandma, and my brother and my sister should be having so much fun either. I need to come up with a good plan to not just ruin their New Year's, but also everyone in the entire planet. And this year seems like a perfect year to ruin everyone's New Year's Eve because of the coronavirus pandemic. I need to ruin my family's New Year so that they'll never ground me. And yes, I got a better idea to ruin everyone's New Year's. And ever since tonight is New Year's Eve, I'll sneak out of this room and destroy, even turning off the lines coming out of the Go City power plant and turn off the electricity for all Go City's residents. But first... I'm going to call Carla to come over here so she can talk about the plan of turning off the electricity and power on New Year's Eve. Hey Carla, how is it going? It's been going very bad, old Kalo. My parents keep grounding me for the stupidest and dumbest reasons. Well, I have a good plan to ruin everyone's New Year Eve for a ball drop on television. Can you please come over to my house so we can talk about the plan on to ruin New Year's? Oh, completely. Absolutely yes. That sounds like a perfect plan. I'll be there at your house in at least 60 seconds or one minute. Goodbye. Okay, old Kalo, I'm there at your house so we can talk about on how to ruin everyone's New Year's. I already talked about the plan that we'll turn off the power and electricity on New Year's Eve. Old Kalo, my boyfriend, that is yet the most genius and best idea you ever came up with all year long. If we can't enjoy New Year's, nobody can enjoy the New Year's celebration. Good night Carla and Old Kalu. And Carla, I thought you invited Old Kalu to come to my house just to sleep with him for only one night. But it's okay. Old Kalu, please let the bed bugs bite all your electronic devices and your Lego sets. We hate your show and annoying theme song. Good night Daddy, we hate Lego movie.
Okay team, seems like a good time to sneak out of the window and turn off and disable the power lines to ruin everyone's new years. Old Kalo, shouldn't we call for Rocket? He can just take us there in a flash. Carla, that's even better. Hey Rocket, can you please come to our room and take us to the Go City power plant? Big Toy Rocket, you made it, and it looks like that our entire family didn't destroy you after all. Come on Old Kalo, we got a mission. Come on. Welcome aboard, buckled and fasten your seat belts. Seat belt buckled. Prepare for blast off. We're going to need more power to blast off. We'll just take off the wooden pieces by controlling it, and put it back once we get out of the house. Now we're going up, controlling it. Blast off. We are now off to the Ghost City power plant to cut off the electricity for every single Ghost City resident that lives in Ghost City. Time to cause this massive blackout to ruin New Year's. Oh look, the countdown timer is about to start now. Oh no, did the power just go out? Did the Y2K happen 18 years ago? I don't know, honey. But it looks like we're going to have to go through the New Year's holiday without any electricity. You know what? No, I am not going to let another New Year's ruined by some stupid power outage. Stores are closed right now. But, the first thing in the morning, I will buy a working generator. But honey, this same thing happened last year where we had to deal with our son old Kalo, and I am sure that everyone else in Go City has the same ideas as you. You'll get caught by the police for generators. I have to agree with Doris Anderson. It's very dangerous to try and buy a high demand item that everyone else in Go City will want it as well. And you can go to jail for that. You know honey, Alice and the great, Kalu and Rosie, I don't mind. It'll be worth as long as we can have power on New Year's Eve. Okay, hide behind the sofa. Honey, I'm just extremely worried that you are going to be caught by the cops. Worry all you want honey. But your mother and your kids will be very thankful to still be alive in the morning when we have our power to work with the TV.